Hello, golf friends. Gary Bates here from the Gary Bates Golf Academy. Thank you for tuning in to Tour Swing Tuesday. I'm a PGA teaching professional and certified V1 video analysis coach. Up here we have Justin Thomas, obviously one of the best players in the world, tremendous ball striker, very long hitter. And so I want to take a look at him with a pressure mat. So this is kind of cool, something different I thought we'd do. And take a look at his weight distribution throughout his golf swing. Some things you would expect and then some other things that might be a surprise to you. So let's take a look at him. You know, beautiful athletic setup, right? Arms hang down, knee line over the balls of feet. So in a good athletic position, not on his heels, um, you know, in a great place to move his body. So let's take a look at him. And you're going to see as he goes back right here. So let's start here on the bottom. Oh, I, I should explain this. Down at the bottom, 50 50s is weight distribution left to right on his left. There you go, 43.57, that's his weight on the heel and the toe, same on the right. So those are the numbers we're going to look at, okay? So taking it into motion right here, so he gets a lot of width in his swing, even his pre-swing, right, gets his arms way away from his side. And you can see as he goes back right here, he's already starting to move into that right side, so 67% of the weight. And so in P2, what we saw called position 2, 66% right. So he's definitely moving right. And uh, that's what you see, you know, with these players. Now, do they move way to the right and sway? No, they rotate around the inside of the foot. You're going to see that, okay? So taking it back right here, he's hinging his wrists, right? Um, when he gets to P3, his club is parallel to the ground or his left arm parallel to the ground, right? You know, he's getting into that right side. Um, and that's interesting. Also, what do you notice? Um, his weight going inside the heels, right? So that 76 on the bottom number, it's going to increase... He's going to get the weight inside the right foot, folks. That's so important. We don't sway to the outside of the right foot. That's a fundamental to me that you got to have. I have some drills I can give you to help you with that, okay? So hinging, right turning. He's trying a tremendous shoulder turn, not much hip turn, so big X factor. And here's that number, sort of, let's go with, you know, top of the swing, I would say somewhere in here. Um, maybe just a little bit further. And yes, okay. So let's take this number here. This looks to be at the top of his swing, 70-30 right there at the bottom. So that's a good number. I like that. That's That makes sense to me, right? So you're not staying in your left like maybe some people would teach. Um, no, you're going to move into your right side with your driver. Now, will your iron stay centered? Yes, but driver moving over, weight in that right foot, very upright swing here, a la Jack Nicholas, right, or Tom Watson. Okay, then he's going to drop it down right here, and you're going to see him really move right away into his left side. So 81% of his weight left right here. <laughs> the other one that's cool is 100% on his toe on the right foot. Goodness gracious, that is amazing. Like, so he's starting down his weight going onto his toe. That means he's moving left. If you're young and you get up on your toe real early, don't worry about it. Tiger Woods, a great career doing that. My brother Pat Bates played the tour many years with that same move. You can do it. Okay. So, moving into the left side, dropping the club down, right? So, you know, bicep and upper arm, now 70% on that left foot, right? So, moving into the left, all right? 100% of the weight on the right toe, all righty then. This is power. Look at the hip rotation. Goodness gracious, that is fantastic, right? Moving to the left side on that shaft line plane. So, a good angle of attack, right? A good swing plane. Obviously, I look at that uh, when, you, when you come for a lesson, here, compressed with his head and, uh, you know, centered out a little bit. But I want you to look at the numbers. <laughs> He's got 100% of his weight on his left and right foot on the toe. Can you see that? 100 to zero. Wow. That's that raising up kind of move that you see with these power hitters, right? Sort of thrusting off the ground here, uh, getting that power. And then moving all the way, obviously, into that left side, you know, so that they finish, you know, 100% of the weight on the left foot, right? And you know, zero on the right there as he goes. So, you know, just a fabulous thing, very powerful and a great model for you youngsters out there starting the game. Thanks for tuning in. If you're on uh, Facebook, well, check it out, Gary Bates Golf Academy. We've got some great Christmas and holiday specials over on YouTube. Subscribe, hit that button, so, uh, select all, tell your friends, give us a thumbs up. What did I forget? Oh, leave a comment. That's it. Yeah, I always love hearing from you. And uh, hey, if we can help you in any way, come on out to the Jersey Devil Golf Center, year-round instruction. We'd love to help you with your game. So God bless you. We wish you the very best holiday season. And we'll look forward to seeing you next time on Tour Swing Tuesday. Bye for now.